Hi guys, all right. Well, here's a YouTube tutorial. I've had a problem today. I was out winging and uh, all of a sudden lost some air. I went home, tried to fix the bladder. I found some holes. I patched the holes up, pretty simple, straightforward, and um, put it back together and discovered there was some more holes. So I've had to take the bladder out the complete bladder. All right, took the whole bladder out, out of my wing, and uh, found some more holes, fixed them up, put the bladder back in the wing, and then uh, the end part exploded as I sort of put it back together, and I thought, shit, what am I gonna do? Living on a small island in, uh, in the Canary Islands, it's gonna take me weeks for a bladder replacement. So I sort of looked for some YouTube tutorials. There was one guy that came up with an iron, sealing it back together. And I thought, there must be a different solution. I've had the end part of my, of my bladder burst, right? This part, so he went across this with an iron. And uh, I thought, hang on, I've got a vacuum sealing machine. All right, something like this. That's going to cost you 50 euros or something. Maybe somebody has it at home. I use it for my food. And uh, I thought this could be a quick solution. So basically what you do is you take your end part of the bladder, put it inside, line it up straight. Okay. Well, I've done it. I've done it two or three times now, but I'm going to show you again. Line it up straight across, across the heat board. All right. Press it down. All right, press it down, and then you press seal. All right. What it does, it does it exactly like in the factory. When the red light comes off, your end part of the uh, of the bladder is sealed. Now take take it off. Hang on, I've got to put you on the side. It's not a professional video, but it might help somebody. Right, and then you can see across here, fully sealed. All right, there we go. So tomorrow morning, I get some talcum powder, and I'm gonna get the bladder back into my wing, and we're gonna go back on the water. Well, guys, I hope this helped, and uh, it's a bit of a lifesaver for some of you, because it was for me. Anyway guys, good luck with the experiment. See you later.